Francis Tiafo versus Felix Ogeliasim is the first quarter final for the Paris Masters for 2022. And both guys have had different roads to get to this stage. Tiafo started the tournament off as the number 16 seed and will take on Sinego, the qualifier in the first round. And he had no troubles with Sinego getting through in straight sets, 6-4, 6-4. In the second round, he took on the exciting youngster Draper, and after an easy first set, he had to fight to win in straights, eventually winning in straight sets 6-3, 7-5. In the third round, he would take on Alex Dimonor, who had just beaten Daniel Medvedev in the previous round. And after an easy first set, again, Tiafo would have to fight in the second, eventually getting through in straights 6-3, 7-6, to advance to the quarterfinal stage. Oje Aliassime entered the tournament as the eighth seed and would get a bye in the first round. In the second round, he would fight against a qualifier, Ema. For the first time in a long time, he was in trouble and had to fight in the third set in a long match, eventually prevailing 6-7, 6-4, 7-6, 8-6 in six the tiebreak. In the third round, he'd take on the wild card and French veteran Jules Simon, who'd been very impressive during the week beating Murray and Fritz. But Oje Aliassime had no problems sending Simon into retirement 6-1, 6-3 to advance to the quarterfinals. These guys have played twice before, with Oje Aliassim leading the head-to-head 2-0, -head with their last match being in Barcelona earlier this year. But the only time they played on a hard court was at the US Open last year, and it was a four-set match. If Tiafo's gonna win, he's gonna have to push Oje Aliassim around. FAA's been very aggressive the last few weeks, and of course, he's on a really good win streak, but he's gotta be aggressive, Tiafo. He's gonna come to the net and be the bigger hitter. If Felix is gonna win this, he's gonna have to serve well and use that forehand. That combination has won him his last three trophies and also has won him his matches this week. So he needs to serve to work and use that forehand and come to the net. He's been doing that a lot as well lately too. This is gonna to be a very fun match. I'm excited to see how Tiafo puts himself up against one of the best players of the moment and the most informed player at the moment. But I'm gonna go with FAA. I think he's gonna win in three sets. I think Big Foe could take a tie break, maybe the first or second. But I think it's gonna be FAA in the end who maybe faces Alcarez or Runa in the semifinals, but let me know down in the comments below. Who do you think is going to win this match?